Chuck Pagano says he does not regret the tra- the trick fake punt call at the end of the game on Sunday. He said he's disappointed with the way the Colts executed, but he doesn't regret calling it. I'm going to have Peter King on in about an hour. Uh, I honestly believe, and I'll ask Peter King this, I think at the end of the year that play gets him fired. I think they'll look at the in, in its entirety – they will look at the organization, Christine, and say, okay, to get to the Super Bowl, we have to beat Belichick. Wouldn't it be better? I mean, I get he's trying to cover his butt here, but I almost think it would be better for him to say, yes, I did mess up. I shouldn't have done that and yeah. take responsibility yes. for it. I think in life, that's just a better thing to do. Right. Just to own your baggage and say, I was an idiot. My bad. Yeah. Brain fart. It happens. So at least you know that he knows he messed up. Because as long as you defend something that, that's poor and everybody right. saw it, right? Like This is not like something that everybody happened. Everybody saw it. Yeah, I got like a 15 rating. Uh-huh. So you're trying to defend something that everybody knows is outrageous. It makes you look worse. You're better off saying, we butchered it. It's on me. And people can say, you know, he's a great coach. He had a bad play. But you start defending it, it gives you 50 more columns for the local columnist mm-hmm. to write, bashing you for defending the indefensible. That's why we're talking about it today.